Maddie. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here. Today's video is going to be part two of my apartment tour. Last week in part one, I showed you my living room, kitchen, and dining room. And today, I'm going to be showing you the rest of my apartment, which is my bedroom, bathroom, and closets. I'm super excited to share this with you guys. Like last time, I'm going to try to be super thorough and tell you exactly where everything is from. And I'll also try to link as much as I possibly can down below anything that is still available. I will link down there if you guys want to shop anything for yourselves. And yeah, I think that's it. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Starting right where we left off last week at this sliding door right off of the kitchen. This is going to bring us to this little hallway. Straight ahead is my closet, which we will get to later. And then to the right, my apartment came with this really cool like matte black accent wall. And on this wall, I just hung up my little 100,000 subscribers plaque from YouTube. This plaque is obviously super meaningful to me and I love having it at like a central place in my apartment so I can look at it every single day. And then on the other side across from that, I have this little corner here where I decided to put this dresser. So you guys will see my bedroom is actually pretty small so I wasn't able to take my big wide dresser that I had at my old apartment with me. So I decided to get this really small, narrow, tall dresser. It's from Ikea and I love how simple it is and I love the black knobs and this just adds some extra storage for folded clothes which is nice so on top of here I just have this framed print from Society6 all the frame prints that you're gonna see in this video are from Society6 and it's just like a line drawing of a little I love you sign in sign language so it's super cute I love how simple it is and then I just have this fake plant, which I believe is from HomeSense. I also just keep my little to-do list kind of planner notepad right here that I can use to make lists and keep organized. So that's all I have on top here. And then I'm going to quickly go through these drawers just so you can see how I organize everything. This top drawer is like awkwardly small. So I just keep all of my sunglasses in here and all my sunglass cases. And then in this big drawer here, I have all of my graphic tees, which clearly I have too many of because this drawer is like overflowing. But that's why they get the big drawer. This drawer is a little disorganized, but that is just all of my tank tops. This drawer is like t-shirts and short sleeve shirts that aren't graphics. This last drawer is all of my long sleeve shirts. That is it for this dresser. Let's go ahead and go this way into the bedroom. Here is my bedroom. I love this room. I think it's actually my favorite part of my whole apartment. I didn't really have that much space to work with in here, so I just wanted to keep it super clean and minimal and just very like comfortable and cozy. Let's go ahead and start with the bed and I'll give you all the details on this. So my bed frame itself is actually from Wayfair. I stopped supporting Wayfair a really long time ago. I bought this bed like a year and a half ago and then last year I learned that Wayfair is like into some sketchy stuff so I stopped supporting them and obviously now like a ton of stuff is coming out about them. I'm going to try to find a similar style to this bed frame from a different company to link down below for you guys but it's just a queen size bed and it has this white like metal frame. All of my bedding right now is from Target. My actual comforter is from Parachute and if you're wondering where that like white quilted duvet cover was from it was also from Parachute but I just switch out my bedding all the time so I still have the quilted one but right now I switched to this really pretty linen white duvet cover from the brand Casa Luna at Target. I just thought the linen was really like summery and beachy so the duvet cover and these pillow shams are both from Target and these sheets are also from Casa Luna from Target. They're 
so soft. They're like a jersey material. And then this blanket is also from Casa Luna. Clearly, I really liked that brand. They had lots of cute stuff, so I love this bedding. It's so comfortable. I love getting into bed every night. Above the bed, I just have three more framed prints from Society6. I love these prints. They're super simple. I brought them with me from my last apartment, and I just think they look so nice above the bed. They're just three different line drawings. I'll show you from this angle so you don't get as bad of a glare, but yeah, they're really cute. These are also the medium size. Now I'm going to show you guys the nightstand situations. So I have two matching nightstands from Ikea. They're actually the same line as the dresser out there. So they have the same like knobs and everything. So it's nice to have some more drawer storage with my nightstands. On both of my nightstands, I have these matching little lamps. They are from Target. They're just like a clear base with some gold accents. Really simple and when they're on, they really like warm up this room. So love those. I just have my Kindle sitting right there. Over here, I just have this little Louis Vuitton book that my mom got me for Christmas, but you can get this a ton of places, so I'll link it down below. Sitting on top of that, I just have this Josie Moran CBD like body lotion and my vanilla Laneige lip mask and also this candle that my friend Ingrid got me for my birthday this year. If you guys have smelled the Sol de Janeiro Bum Bum Cream, this is the candle version of that. It's incredible. It makes my whole room smell like that lotion, which is my favorite scent ever. So love this. Thanks, Ingrid. And then I'll show you guys in these drawers. So in this top drawer, I keep all of my face masks. Over here are all of my like reusable face masks and then these are all my sheet masks and then I also keep all of my hair accessories like headbands clips stuff like that back there and then this drawer down here is all of my self tanning stuff so I have all my loving tan over here and then my Isle of Paradise face tanning spray some mitts over here other brands back there so that's all the tan stuff. Before we go over to the other side of the room, I just have this mirror on this little wall right here. This is just a really pretty gold round mirror. It's from Target. I think it really completes this little corner. So yeah. Also, if you haven't noticed, I have lots of gold accents throughout my whole room. Let's go ahead and go over to the other nightstand. Over here, same Ikea nightstand, same Target lamp. I just have this big candle going. I think I got this from Home Sense or Home Goods, one of those stores. It's a really nice, like, summery scent. And then also from Home Sense, I have this little lavender sleep pillow spray. And then I also just have these two little white marble coasters which are from Target a really long time ago and yeah that's all that's up here. This top drawer here is like my random drawer. I keep all my electronics in here and then some like sleep gummies and stuff like that. Down here is my travel drawer so any little travel size bottles of anything I keep in here. I know it looks messy but <laughs> I kind of just throw them all in here and then when I go to pack for a trip, it's super nice because I just have all my travel size stuff in here and I can just grab everything and go. So it makes packing super easy. That is it for my nightstands. Okay, so moving to this wall over here. Once again, this room, just like my living room, has these built-in shelves below the windows. Starting over here, I just have a little tissue box hidden back there. But right here, I have my jewelry. Jewelry stand is from Urban Outfitters, and I just keep all of my necklaces on there, and a couple bracelets, a couple rings. And then this little box is from CB2, and I just keep all of my earrings in there. In the middle here, I have this tray from Target, and I just keep a couple perfumes on there. Hidden down here is like my little office, so I have my printer, just because there's no other good place for it, and I feel like you can't really see it down here anyway. And then I have this organizer from Target where I just keep like files and papers and stuff that I need. And then this little corner over here is my favorite. I just have some fresh sunflowers right now that I got from the farmer's market over the weekend. Those are sitting on these two books. I have this Coco Chanel book and then the Ultimate Sneaker book, which is really cool. It has like a bunch of history behind a ton of different sneakers. This thing over here is a little candle holder from Anthropology. It's super cute. 
and then I just have a candle in there that I think is from Home Goods. On the ground down here, I have this basket from Home Sense where I just have a bunch of books thrown in there. I read all my books on my Kindle now, but I just had some older books that I didn't want to get rid of that I just put in this basket here. Yeah, so that is it for all of those built-in shelves on this wall. Kitty, say hi. Moving back this way on this wall over here, I have my TV. I didn't have a TV in my room in my last apartment and I kind of missed it. Sometimes I just like to lay in bed at night and watch a show or something. So I decided to mount a TV on this wall here. Then this way on the wall, I have these two black hooks from Target. They're just like command strip hooks that you stick on the wall. And I just put some of my favorite most used bags up here this is the remote for the like air conditioning and then this basket down here i keep my workout stuff in so i have some yoga mats my gym bag some like hand weights and this basket is from target then we circle back this way and we are back at the door so that is it for my bedroom let's go ahead back out to this hallway now it's time for my closet Ta -da. So here is the closet. It's kind of set up weird because obviously I have this rack to hang my clothes here, but there's all these shelves that are built in back here. But if I were to fill this up with clothes, I wouldn't be able to get to the shelves. So that's a little weird, but I basically just store stuff on those shelves that I don't really reach for very often. And then if I need to get to them, I just push the clothes to the side and it's not too bad. I have all my hanging clothes here. I have it all organized by color. I've always organized my closet by color ever since I was little. And then I'll just quickly show you guys what's on these shelves back here. So starting from the top, I have some laundry baskets and inside of there is Kitty's carrier. And I have some other random like kitchen stuff back there. On this shelf, I have some like office-y supplies. These are mailers to send out Poshmark packages in. This shelf here is like my linens. So I have extra towels, extra sheets. On this shelf down here, I have four of these white baskets from Target. And on the far left basket, I have all my hats. This basket right here is all of my extra bags. This basket is all my swimsuit tops, and then this is all swimsuit bottoms. Then moving on to the shoes down here. So you guys saw these in a vlog. All of these containers are from the container store. They are made for shoes, so the door just like pops open like that, and it makes organizing your shoes so satisfying. So on this shelf right here, I just have all my heels. And on the floor down here, I have all my sneakers. And then these over here on the side are just more like slides and some more heels. Here, I just have this little basket from Target where I keep extra hangers. And all the hangers are from Target too. And then over here is just my vacuum and my Swiffer thing. So yeah, that is the closet. I try to keep it pretty organized. I think I did an okay job. Now moving on this way. Now we're gonna get to my bathroom and my bathroom's set up kind of cool. So this like hallway right here is my sink and this is like my vanity where I get ready in the morning. And then that room back there is where the toilet and the shower are. It's kind of nice having like the separate rooms and the door closing off the toilet and shower from the sink. First thing here is this rug. This is from Ruggable. I have wanted this rug for so long and I just never had a space for it until I moved here and I thought it would be perfect. I love animal print. I love zebra. So I thought this was just a fun addition to my apartment. It's perfect and this is also machine washable. Let's go ahead and go to the sink area. So it's pretty wide. There's lots of countertop space. Above the sink is this really nice round black mirror. This came with the apartment. So did these lights and the lighting's actually really good for getting ready. Down here, let's go ahead and go from left to right. In this corner back here, I have two of these matte black canisters. They're from CB2. So in this one over here, I just have Q-tips and then this one here, I have spoolies and some of these little things. I think these are technically like lipstick applicators, but I use them for when I have lash extensions to clean my lashes. So 
kind of random, but I have those there. And then I just have this body lotion from Necessaire and my Replica Beach Walk perfume. This is like my everyday perfume, so I just have it here for easy access. Moving this way, I have this little organizer. I think this is from Target, and I just keep all of my makeup brushes in there. This little black water cup and this toothbrush holder are also both from Target. We have my sink and then this little black soap dispenser is from CB2. I tried to go for an all black theme up here and I try to keep the countertop super clean and minimal. Over here I have this little tray. I think this is like a soap dish tray from Target but I just put my jewelry in here when I'm not wearing it. Like if I'm in the shower or something over here we have another canister where i keep my reusable cotton rounds and then we have this nice fake plant that i believe is from home sense down here this whole sink came with some nice storage so in this drawer on the right i keep all of my most used skincare it's kind of organized this is like Cleansers, serums, moisturizers, and then some other stuff kind of mixed in there. Deodorant, toothpaste. These white plastic organizers are from Ikea. That's all the skincare drawer. Down here, I have this little black basket that is from the container store. And I just keep random stuff, makeup wipes, hairbrush down here. Cat litter down there. And then over here, I have another one of those black baskets. And I just keep my extra hand towels in there and then in this drawer on the left of the sink is all of my most used makeup concealers powders blushes bronzers highlights and then everything else right here that is my makeup drawer and that's pretty much it i have this hook right here it's like a command strip hook that i got from target and i just hang my hand towels on here all my towels are from Target. That's pretty much it for the bathroom sink area. You can see behind me, there is another closet. Turning this way, on the left side of the closet, focus, we have my washer and dryer. This is huge having an in-unit washer and dryer. I am very thankful for that. On this side, it gets a little crazy over here. We just have all of this built-in storage. It's like organized, but it's just a lot. I'm gonna go quickly through this. On top, I just have some backup toilet paper, paper towels, that kind of stuff. This shelf right here, I have this acrylic thing. All of the acrylic organizers up there, down here, they're all from the container store. And this one up here, I have a bunch of kitty stuff. So her brush, her um, catnip, stuff like that. And then I just have the Swiffer things. On this shelf up here, those are all of my like travel cosmetic bags. I have some extra masks. And then that stuff back there is like random extra toothpaste, nail stuff, extra razors, stuff like that. This shelf, we have all of my jeans. So I kind of ran out of drawer storage. So we kind of spilled over to using these shelves. So I just have all my denim on this shelf. And then this shelf here is all my sweatpants. I try to keep it in color order just so it looks nice. This way, on this shelf here, I have my laundry stuff, my steamers back there. This shelf right here is like my medicine cabinet. I don't have a medicine cabinet anywhere else, so I just keep everything here. I have all my vitamins and, you know, any medicine essentials in here moving down this way i have more clothes here these are just all of my sweat shorts in this organizer here i have just some extra lotion there's some more perfumes back there more stuff in here i have my makeup removers more lotion teeth whitening strips down here i have two of these organizers from the container store they're really nice because they're drawers so they slide right out, which is amazing. This one on the left here is all my hair stuff. So just a ton of hair products in both of those drawers. This one over here on top, I just have extra makeup. This is all my lip products. And then back there is like eyeshadows and just stuff that I don't use all that often. 
And then down here is extra skincare. So I have some serums, some exfoliating stuff here, some more cleansers back there. Back there, I just have all of my eyeshadow palettes. Down here, I have this bucket where I just keep all of my hair tools, some extra tampons, and then this is cleaning supplies in here. On the ground down here, I have four of these clear baskets and these two over here are stuff that I've been sent obviously I get sent a lot of packages and get to try out a ton of products which I absolutely love but sometimes I just can't get to it all so whenever I get stuff sent to me I set it back here and I'll either use it or give it to friends or donate it this drawer in here is stuff that I bought that are like backups that I will be using soon and then this is all of my sun stuff. So like tanning stuff, oils, SPFs, all that good stuff. Then I have these four drawers here. So on top, I just have my underwear, bras, bralettes. This is my sock drawer. In this drawer, I have my biker shorts on this side and then just other like gym shorts on this side. And then down here, I have sports bras and leggings. And that is it for this closet. I love all of the built-in storage that comes in this apartment. It's amazing. Closing that back up. Lastly, I just have one more little room to go and that is my bathroom. Here it is. I love this bathroom. It feels like a hotel bathroom. So let's go ahead and start over here. On this wall over here, it came with this built-in shelf, which is really nice. So I just put these two prints. These were in my living room in my old apartment. So they are also from Society6. So I just have them kind of leaning against the wall there. Over here, I have this container from HomeSense. It's a little big for the shelf, but it's not gonna fall off. And in there, I just keep tampons. And then over here, I have this little candle going. This is from a little boutique in my hometown. My mom got it for me for my birthday. And then I have my dry brush. Down here, I have Kitty's litter box. I just have this mat here from Target that like catches the litter when she comes out. And then I have this little black trash can from Target. My beautiful toilet. And over here, I just have some extra toilet paper and some like cleaning stuff. Then over this way, we have my towels. The hooks came with the apartment, so I just have my towels hanging here. And also I have my Pottery Barn robe hanging there. Moving this way, we have the shower. So I'll take you guys into my shower. So this is the shower side and then over here, it's probably going to echo really bad, but all of this storage came with the apartment. So this little shelf thing down here, I just keep all of my most used products. So like body wash, shampoo, conditioner. And up here on this shelf is my stuff that I don't use all the time, but I just have some hair masks, shaving cream, exfoliators, stuff like that. So... That's pretty much it for the shower. Closing that up. And then down here, I just have my little laundry hamper. This is from the container store. And then we are back where we came from. And that concludes this apartment tour. Okay, guys, that is all for my apartment tour. I hope you guys liked it. Once again, I will try to link as much as I possibly can down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I love you guys so, so much. And I will see you in another new video very soon. Bye.